What's going on guys? Apple Advanced here. Today I'm going to show you guys how to download GBA files back again on your iOS 6 device 7, 8, or 9 and you can be on the iOS 10 betas. Now if you guys are going to enjoy the video, don't forget to drop that thumbs up down below. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and do so right now and let's begin with today's tutorial. Now I said this in a couple previous videos, I the people who actually, you know, put these apps out there they usually you know update you on Twitter and stuff like that and I literally stalk these people's Twitter so that I can make the video for you guys the fastest this one time it um this one time you know we hadn't had GBA for I was coming out or Providence nothing was coming out so for literally three hours straight I was looking for a new method for Providence to get you guys not only GBA GBA um, games but um, also Sega games Games. and um, that video turned out to be really good so my three hours of my life that I wasted on that video ended up not going to waste as I got a crazy 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 amount of views on that video so if you were one of those people who watched those videos really thank you um, and also if you're a person who gets notifications thank you for turning my notifications on or if you're just a regular subscriber or just a person who likes my videos and just watches them on a daily basis thank you but anyways guys um that's really it i'm just gonna go ahead and just start you guys off so you want to run to the link in the description below and um it'll take you to safari it'll take you to the site right here and once you're on the site it'll say home apps and help you want to go on apps scroll down all the way till you can find this a looking logo it'll say gba for ios 2.1 it'll say revoked like in the corner go ahead and click download page once you click on it now once you scroll down it's gonna say two GBA for iOS's okay you want to click the one that says signed go ahead and click the one that says sign click install then click install one more time and it'll come up with the prompt asking you would you like to install GBA for iOS it's actually really easy from here just click install now you just want to go ahead and you just let it actually download I'm gonna go ahead and actually switch to LTE um, for cellular real fast because I want to go ahead and download this real fast I don't want to uh, waste my time with 3g as 3g is very slow and um, you know I'm not wasting my time with that and I especially I use LTE for my videos as it just installs and installs apps faster and stuff like that but basically right when you click download it should just begin to download or something like that sometimes um, a, another thing is if it says waiting just keep saying waiting the app may not just work anymore so if you're just getting this thing where it just says waiting um, this may be an old video or it just may have gotten revoked very fast because I have made a video where um, I literally stalked the developers Twitters like the people who actually send these apps out actually make them so you guys can download them um, I literally saw it like it said one minute ago GBA for iOS is back so I downloaded it I immediately like five minutes later made a thumbnail which is that picture that you see before you click on the video I made that and then I made the video and about took an hour for everything to come together right um, because I took a 45 minute break um, in between the video and the thumbnail <laughs> um, but then after that um, I was getting people um, saying on their Twitter that it doesn't work and I was like no nah, I just made a video on it it obviously works so I was like, okay, you know what? I'm going to test it before I release it. I deleted the app, downloaded it again, did the whole process again, and it didn't download. Meaning, um, emulators have become such a problem to Apple that they are literally all not only you know um, trying to take down these apps and stuff like that, they're stalking the developer's Twitter. So that's why I try stranding away from iEmulator sometimes because really iEmulators.com's apps get revoked the fastest. Um, and I mean, I've really noticed this. Um, people might say, no, they really don't. I've personally noticed this a lot and that's why you've not been seeing me do that many videos on iEmulators.com as their emulators get actually pretty done with pretty fast um i think it's because apple's like um team that they have to like um i guess block all these emulators and stuff like that well i guess they somehow keep up with iemulators.com and i don't think they're too familiar with these other sites like emus for you emu for ios i think they're actually uh familiar with emu for ios.net but they're not familiar with like iosemus.com or anything like that and to me 
that's crazy. Um, that's crazy that Apple is literally watching every move and stuff like that. And it not only helps uh, when like a person like me obviously makes a video about it because then it gets even more publicity and um, more people get you know know about it. And then you share it with your friend like, bro, I have a Game Boy game emulator on my phone. Like, look at this. I am playing Game Boy games on my iPhone. Word gets around. Apple gets the word and then Apple shuts it down. So if you're wondering why it's not working for you, that's really why. Um, it's just Apple does, this is not what Apple wants for their iPhones. Um, but, you know, for like Windows devices, so if you have like a Windows computer, you can actually download a Game Boy Advance app and stuff like that. But you know what? Enough of the rambling. Let's go ahead and focus on the app. So, um, you're just going to wait for it to download, like about where it gets to how much it is about right now. Um, out of nowhere, literally out of nowhere, um, you want to pay attention to it. Um, out of nowhere, it will just immediately just, just, I guess, download like super fast. Um, you really won't expect it. As you can see, it'll just download super fast and it'll install. Now, if you're on iOS 6, 7, or 8, um, this is basically it for you. you. You have the emulator on your device. Now you only have to download the emulators, which is actually pretty easy in and of itself. If you do not know what to search up on YouTube, just type in how to get Game Boy games on GBA for iOS or how to get games on GBA for iOS, how to get ROMs on GBA for iOS. There's literally hundreds and hundreds and hundreds upon videos on YouTube about it. But if you're on an iOS 9 device or iOS 10 betas or anything like that, once you click on it, it's going to say Untrusted Enterprise Developer. Click Cancel. Scroll over till you can find Settings. Once you're on Settings, go to General. Scroll down all the way until you can find Profiles and Device Management. Once you find Profiles and Device Management, you want to scroll down one more time and click on this one right here. Click Trust. It's going to come up to prompt access you would you like to trust or not go ahead and click trust one more time and there you go you have access to gba for ios now i know i talked a lot while it was downloading but i really wanted to come across with you guys and tell you guys of why these things do not work and how um my the channels like mine impact you know how the app actually ends up staying long so um you know now that i'm actually getting quite a quite amazing views on my videos you know i'm starting to get way more out there and to the point where people are sharing my videos more and more so i just really wanted to explain to you guys how everything has an impact on these things and it's not because apple hates you that they're doing this it's just because you know they're not allowed to have nintendo type of things on their device and you know what? it's totally normal from a business standpoint but we um and my channel are fighting back against this we're fighting apple while we love apple anyways guys if you enjoyed the video don't forget to drop that thumbs up down below if you haven't already subscribed go ahead and do so right now this has been apple advanced and see you guys